good kitten internet. Oh, I forgot to turn on my lights. One moment. There, that should look a little bit better. So, I've leveled everybody up to level 11, and I mean everybody. Well, except for Gerhalt, since he was already above 11. <sighs> Took a little while. Had to do some hinky jankies to make it not take forever. Not gonna worry too much about that. Um, so, currently up above me are the stats of all of the archers, or archer-like characters. Obviously, Eric and Tyrin are not comparable because they're unpromoted, but... And also, I don't have access to them, so I can't do anything about it. But you can see, one thing I wanted to point out is that Kazin is terrible. I did finally figure out that he's actually agility-based, but he's terrible. Let's not use him ever. I mean, for comparison, let's look at Kazin versus Teya, who we just gained and is pre-promoted. Teya has three more defense and eight fewer agility. Taya's also terrible, <laughs> but pre-promoted characters are usually terrible in Shining Force 2, so having terrible pre-promoted Archer Force 2 characters is not exactly shocking. Um, but look at the comparison with my uh, the ones that I actually use. These are much better characters. I mean, yes, Gazin more has more hit points than the Brass Gunner and Bow Knight, but fewer hit points than the two snipers, and Gazin's also a sniper. Uh, and far lower attack, which is kind of the most important stat on an archer. Uh, let's see, what else do we have? Um, let's go ahead and expand everything. Uh, let's see, what did I else did I want to compare? Oh, melee characters. So let's go, and I should mention that all of the attack stats are based off of using the best available weapon that you can buy. So I do actually have one weapon that's a mithril weapon, and I did not use that for comparison because I can't equip that on everybody. So it's not a very good comparison. So let's see, we've got Bird Battler, uh, we've got Master Monk, Ninja, Paladin. Wolfbaron and Baron. There we go. These are our melee characters, as in the characters who can reach out and punch something. Uh, you're going to notice something a little weird about Higgins. I'll get to that in a moment. Do you see something slightly off? Just very slightly off of having like 21 extra attack. So remember, Kiwi was promoted at level 40. Level 40 promoted characters are nuts. Uh, Kiwi has better stats in every way than every other character. Like, there is not any one of these stats other than defense that is lower than another character. And defense, mind you, Master Monks are healers. They're not meant to have good defense. And Kiwi still has some of the best defense of the party. Uh, Kiwi is tied for Sarah, who I can conclusively say is actually that. Um... Sarah has better defense than Luke, even though Luke leveled up, or Luke promoted one level higher. Although Sarah's uh, hit points are pretty abysmal, and the attack's not so great either. So I definitely chose the right ninja, because I prefer characters who have higher have higher attack, because the game rewards you for having higher attack. Um, but remember, Luke is god-tier stats. Um, although I'm starting to wonder if it's actually not god-tier, but if it's actually both attack and hit points instead. That might be it, actually. Anyway, um, so we all... Keep in mind, some of these stats are going to be a little off because I've had to use up items to increase things. So, for instance, I gave Bowie extra defense. That's the only reason why his defense is 45 and not much lower. Um... But you, we can take a look at this and see that Bowie ha definitely has the lowest defense, even with all the promotion items that we have given him. Um, Karna would have super low defense, but again, unpromoted. Uh, in fact, actually, let's just remove that entirely. It's unpromoted characters, that's not a fair comparison. So, the Slash. So, Paladins have the ability to equip both Spears and Lances. Lances are range 1 attack weapons, which is the same excuse me, as any other melee weapon. Spears are range 1 to 2 attack weapons, which is similar to an unpromoted archer. 
So Higgins has 66 attack using the short range weapon right now, and 61 attack using a longer range weapon. So I'm going to be comparing Higgins to both the regular classes and the archers, for reference. Um, Higgins has one extra hit point than Sarah, lower attack, lower defense, lower agility. Higgins is not a good character. He wasn't very good in Shining Force 2 base either, so that's, again, normal. In fact, Higgins was one of the worst characters in the game. But you'll notice that Sarah and Higgins are the two lowest attacking characters of all of the melee that we have. All of these are much higher melee attack. So I think we're choosing correctly. Defense-wise, Janet is awesome. Randolph is doing okay. Uh, yeah. What else we got? So... Oh, let's take a look at our archers. Again, this time with the paladin as well, because I forgot to compare that. Bow Knight, Brass Gunner, Snip. Alright, now you'll notice that if Higgins was an archer at 61 attack, he would be below all of the other archers that we have in the party, although not by much. Uh, as we will level up a little bit more, I think Higgins would actually surpass them. But keep in mind, Higgins has one fewer range, so he's a little bit worse than an archer. He is also worse in every way than Slade, by a large margin. Uh, I've got nothing for that one. Other than Higgins has better movement, I should mention that. Uh, yeah. So, long story short, I'm not taking any of the new characters. And I'm not even going to take any of the... Uh, Older characters that we skipped over for a bit. One th oh, I forgot to add in. Sorry about that. Um, hold on. Let's go back to our melee characters. Red Battler. Baron. Master Monk. I forgot the monster. Ninja. Paladin. Wolf Baron. So, I forgot to include our monster, Peter. Remember Peter? The one that was completely useless. Sorry, Peter. Uh, apologizing to one viewer that I know that I that would be watching, whose name is actually Peter. Um, he's increased hit points quite a bit in the seven levels that he leveled up. Uh, I believe it's about double. I think he was at 16 before, now he's at 32, which still is woefully inadequate and can get one-shotted by spells once we start fighting things with Freeze 4, which is coming up very soon. Um, his attack, however is the same as Higgins, with much better defense and lower agility, because Peter's agility is terrible. But the point I wanted to make was, we've got Randolph and Peter, who are the monster classes that we have, which is to say that they don't use weapons, they just use unarmed attack and just have really high stats. Randolph is actually a good character. He's got three fewer hit points than Janet, two more attack, and four less defense. And two fewer agility. That four fewer defense. Anyway, um, it's comparable. And that's fine. I needed a second tank. I may not actually need Randolph any longer. The, the, he was the character that I was thinking about swapping out if needed. I don't think I need to. Because there's nobody that I would end up taking, most likely. Um... What else do we have? Oh, uh, Screech. We need to talk about Screech, because I did not even look at his spells. So, Screech has Dao, Neptune, Boost, and Katon. Those are really nice spells. Um, he's a better sorcerer than Gerhalt in terms of what spells that he has. Um, basically, I'm replacing Egress and Slow for Neptune and Katon. Katon is... Eh, it's not the greatest spell right now, but it's better than nothing. Oh, I didn't even notice Screech is only using a power stick. Uh, that means his attack comparison's off. Whatever, doesn't matter. I'm not going to care. That just means that Screech actually has some extra defense. Here, let's do the comparison really fast, and I'll show you how I was doing it. So, oops. Sorry. 
Uh, so I actually just walked into the weapon shop here and was pretending to buy the Guardian Staff, in this case. So Screech's attack is actually 41. Oh, I did actually record it. Good. Never mind. We're good. Anyway, um, let's take a look at our mages for a comparison, and you're going to see something weird. So that is... Mage. Did I never actually edit where it says Wiz instead of Mage? I never edited it. Whoops. Well, I'll fix that really fast. And Zork. You're actually Wiz. There we go. Anyway, um, so keep in mind, Gerhalt is one level higher, but has 20 extra hit points, 6 extra MP, 3 extra attack, 3 extra defense, and 20 extra agility. I think we can safely say that this might also be one of his primary stats. Anyway, the reason why is that we promoted Ger Gerhalt not at level 20. But Sorcerers, it's not that big of a deal to have fewer stats for most things. Hit points... Uh, I'm not happy about that. 39 hit points is abysmal. I mean, that's barely higher than... Uh, Peter. So... I think I might be keeping Gerhalt in the party, even though Screech has better magic. And the reason being... So yeah, here's the situation. Screech has Dao, Neptune, Boost, and Katon. The boosts are going to be equivalent, I'm not concerned about that. Honestly, I don't need this many characters with boost anyway. Boo, uh, boo. No, that's the kitty that's upstairs right now. Um, Dao, Neptune, and Katon are his attack spells. We've got Dao in both characters, so it's Neptune and Katon. Katon 2 has a range of 3, which means that it's actually a very useful spell right now when Randolph can only get to range 2. However, we have so damn many archers in this party that it might not actually be all that big of a deal. I think I'm going to give him a shot. I have to go outside for this. Right. I think I'm going to give him a shot. This may be a mistake. Uh, let's go ahead and... This is why I level everybody up. And I'm doing that offline, so to speak. Because, one, no. And two, I'm kind of partially exploiting the game in order to be able to get it up this high. This fast. Because it doesn't really matter. I'm just leveling up characters that I'm not using. And it's not like I couldn't do it legitimately to begin with. Alright. Oh, also, I have all of the rings unequipped right now. That way I had good comparison on things and I knew what to give to people. Give Guardian Staff over to Screech. Not used. Also, give the Intra Staff over to Screech. I never ended up using it, but that's because I'm not running out of MP, whereas Screech is definitely low on MP. Oops. Equip. Screech. Guardian Staff. Okay. Now time to analyze who should get which ring. I'm pretty certain that Bowie's still the one that should get the Protect Ring. I need to adjust who's in the party and who isn't. I'll worry about that later. Um, let's go ahead and remove Excel. Depot. Derive. I don't know why they use Derive, but whatever. Quick ring. So, who's going to need extra agility that's actually in the party? Uh, so Screech's agility is the lowest by far. Yeah. With the quick ring equipped, Screech's agility is the lowest in the party. That answers that question. Protect ring is going to be Bowie. Running ring. Um, Randolph is who I've had it equipped on. I'm probably going to continue equipping it on Randolph. Yeah. Actually, wait, I have Mithril in my inventory somewhere. Uh, 
Also, Brave Apple is going into the storehouse. There it is. Okay. Finally, I have power milk that I need to use. Um, I could be completely ridiculous and equip and use power milk on one of my master monks, but I think I'm going to use it on one of the archers instead. So, let's see. Of my snips, you've got 65 attack, you've got 62. It's going on Elric. Apparently, I've received an email. Elric. One direction. Elric. Going to save state, which I now have a little command thing for. I'm using this analog stick for up is save state, down is load state, and right is fast forward. Two, no. Just, I would rather not use it at all. Anyway, oh, I need to equip things. Uh, let's see, so we had Screech needs to equip the quick ring, so he ever gets to go. And Screech's agility may be increasing quite a bit soon enough. The reason why is that he's he's never leveled. So, oops. No, you are equipping Critical Sword, thank you very much, and Protect Ring. Who has the Power Ring? Did I not hand out the Power Ring? Ah. Uh, it's been a day. Had therapy appointment earlier today. Uh, let's see, attack. I'll equip that on Elric. That'll do. All right. See, it's so much easier now that I don't have to reach over to the keyboard to hit fast forward or not. Anyway, we are going to head back. Also, my emulator window was over quite a bit for some reason. We're going to head back. Although first, we're going to go up here. I think we might need to do this first. This is the city of Mound. Remember, door's locked. So we can't get through at this point, and we were told to go to Nazca, which is through Mound. So we need to head back to Pakalon. This is the point in the game where you have to go to Pakalon for reference. Hey, look, it's wet. Kingdom of Fine Centaurs, we welcome you. Water fountain's still empty. I don't know why. But hey, look, there's puddles everywhere now. I see Geshup frequently. Always stares at the castle. Hmm, that seems suspicious. Regular item shop. Yeah, I guess at this point of the game, we're going to have plenty of money because there's nothing to spend it on. Because I, we're mostly done with equipment that we can buy. Is there not a weapon shop here? There it is. Just making sure there was nothing else. Nope, this is all die. Items. Items? Items. So yeah, it's been a very long day. I've worked long, hard, exhausted. Had to have to work after my therapy appointment. Vicar Freya wants to go to Mountain and save the people, but the devils will surge into Parmesia the moment as soon as he opens the gate. Thank you. You defeated Zalbard and saved Machula. You are a trustworthy soldier, so do your favor. Please go to Mountain with me. What are you going to do there? I believe there are survivors in Mount. I would like to save them. Oh, we have to go through Mound to get to Dazka. 
That's a lovely typo. Bowie, let's go together. All right. Bowie decides to take Freya with him. Thank you very much. I think we would be saved by humans. All right, and now let's first off. The suspiciously located priest. Oops, did not mean to hit raise, mean to hit save. All right, and let's head toward Moun. What? Finally, you've left the castle, Fricker Freya. Yeah. So, you remember me? What do you want? I have plans for you. I'm very happy that you've come out of the castle. Why? I have been waiting for Freya. Vicar Freya, you locked the gate of Mound, remember? My faithful soldiers can't enter Parmesia. Now you will open it. It's a trap! Freya, run! <laughs> he can't. Camilla! Camilla! Camilla? We met her in Pangoat Valley. We've never used the term Pangoat Valley until now. What? Ah, Camilla, you're finally here. Get the key for me. Cash up. You're as devious as usual. And I am. Now go get the key. Me? Why? Camilla! I hate you! I can't help you. You want the key? You get it. You can use my army. See you later. Toodles. That witch. Camilla! Camilla! Hmm, I'm divided. I don't need your help, Camilla. Come on, devils! Kill Bowie now! Bye, Bowie. Hm, you're not staying. I'm good at using my brains, not my strength. Return by the time you're defeated. All right, let's see what we've got. We've got Dark Bishop and a Master Monk. Wait, seriously, we're fighting Dark Bishop still? Okay. And necromancers who have range three freeze. Good to know. We also have devil soldiers who have boost two and never use it. It's a good thing too, because we would be boned if they understood the good word of boost. Got some harpy queens with freeze twos. Master monks. We're actually surrounded by the way, other than above. Dark knights. Orc Lords, which Orc Lords dispel on attack. Whatever. And there's nothing up there. Let's take a look at the map. Okay. So we've got a couple of options on how we want to do this. We could just burst through the middle, but we're really outnumbered in there. So the, typically what you want to do, I'll use my mouse to indicate, is that you go out this way and around. That way you're not biting off more than you can chew. That's probably what I'm going to do. Oops. No, not no pet plus plus. All right. Remember, Kiwi is not just ludicrously awesome at healing. Kiwi is also our best melee character right now. So Kiwi is going to start leveling up like mad soon. We should go preach the good word. Good word. Honk. Jaha with 92 def uh, MP. Jeez.
Boing. Oh, I can't fly in above that wall for some reason. That's weird. And unfortunate. Uh... Huh. Your movement's seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I'm nowhere near. Oh, one thing to note is that a lot of this particular battle is land effect zero percent. So we're going to be taking more damage than normal, unfortunately. There's not much we can do about it either. I think that devil soldier is the boss. I think. Closer? No. Okay. Mean, mean. Alright. Randolph, yes, you should be one of my front line. Screech. I can get three with boost. Oh, I can see how I can get more. Boom. Oh yeah, I should show. Oh no, it's Canton four. Or Canton three that has the extra range. Well, crap. Oh, well. you still haven't seen Neptune, so it's worth it. See, that is the female Sorceress appearance. I definitely prefer the male. But it's nice that they actually have two sets of sprites. They're going to try to attack down below. Mean, mean. I don't know why I have to do that every time. I just do. This is still really far away. Covering my retreat, so to speak. Sorry, my tongue's burned, if you're wondering why I'm constantly fiddling with it. No, not heal three. Heal one. Didn't move even though they could attack. Interesting. I wonder if I broke the air script slightly. Huh. Well, this is a little too comfortable for me. Hi. Freeze three. Unfortunately, boost is expiring, and that's not a great time to have boost expire. Oh, right, you're a baron. I need to remember that. You're not an archer. Always forget. Mean, mean? Ninja stab? Hmm. I actually can bolt three now, oddly enough. Not that I'm going to, but it's good to know that I can. <sighs> yeah, let's go ahead and ninja stab. Nice dodge, Luke. Good job. Ulrich leveled up. No attack again. Uh. 
That would be a terrible idea. That's still a terrible idea. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Bowie, I'm sorry, you're going to have to stay back. These people are way too dangerous. Goodbye, Orc Lord. Boom. I am a very tempting target for a um, blast, though, unfortunately. Could just bring a healer down here, too, now that I'm thinking about it. Yeah, let's do that. Of course, they go after the healer and not before. Grumble. Grumble, I say. Oh, crap, there's a Dark Knight over there. Um... Screech, you head down there. Could have preached the good word now that I think about it. That might have been a smarter idea. Orc Lord, take some damage, please. I just realized that Elric's gonna die. Oh, no. Oh, Elric's boosted. Okay, good. Uh, he might still die from a blast instead of them healing. I'm going after Randolph. Okay. Go right ahead and attack my highest defense character of the party. Oh, he's not highest defense. He's second highest defense. Sorry. Yep, you're gonna attack Luke. I don't know why the two of them didn't just gang up on Luke. That would have been a smarter move. All right, are you gonna heal yourself? Yes, good. That's what I wanted you to do. Because otherwise you would have actually taken out one of my characters and I didn't want that. Bonk. Blink. There you go, Randolph, have some healing. Hello, Jaha. Hey, look, you have more targets. Hmm. So one of them actually has the ability to freeze, which means I shouldn't use freeze. I should use something else. Screw it. Bolt it is. Critical hit, nice. Necromancer is scary. Alright. Oh, puddles or land effect 30%. Good job, game. Uh, anyway, you need to die. Mean, mean. Stabity? Okay. Aw, no crit. Getting good with the dodges. Elric, uh, you need to kill something. Yeah, go after the Harpy Queen. That sounds like a good plan. Ooh, almost killed it, too. Ha! Ah, why is the Harpy Queen going already? That's not even close to the right in it order. Grumble. Grumble. Debating as to whether I just egress and start over. Three. 
Uh, Slade is now the highest defensive character I have. He has 62 defense, doesn't he? Yep. His defense is one higher than Janet's. I've got a... tank of archer I swear I've had that happen in one of my games before. Okay. Can't reach anything useful. Do I just go on without Ulrich? I think... I think I am. I don't want to fight this battle again. I'm already halfway in. Although, if I lose two characters, that might be a different story. 73! I didn't even get a chance to use Screech, because Screech hasn't gone again. Yep, I'm egressing. Forget this. What's your attack like? 60. What's your defense like? 48. So you'll take 12 expected. Screw it. Bonk. Mm. So glad I'm still not playing the Nuzlocke. Screech hasn't even attacked anybody yet. You know what? Fine. Everybody's going to go this way now.
I lived, it's okay. Sort of. Uh, timing was not great on just on that, but all. It's safe now. Ish. There we go. Now I can show you what Neptune looks like. This is horrible overkill, but I'm doing it anyway. This is Neptune. It rains. It does crap tons of water damage. That's it. It's nice and peaceful rain. I'm really confused as why they're not attacking Luke, but okay. Yep. Attack that archer. It's only my strongest defensive character in the game. I was expecting a blast, okay. Do you not have blast? I thought they did no they don't. Okay, that explains it. Well Mimi, let me introduce you to Mr. Freeze. Oh. Hi. Bye. Kiwi's such an awesome character right now. It's also not a phrase I say all that often. Okay, your movement's seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. I'm gonna go mess up the Master Monk some. Let me check to see where other things are. Um, your movement seven, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Go deal with you. Goodbye. Don't want to deal with healers right now. So, somebody's going to get attacked twice. That's the downside. And that might kill me, come to think of it. Okay, they didn't get activated. Cool. Um, yeah, I can still go through there. We're just gonna move off to the side for a bit, Chester, because you took a nasty fall. Hey, look, I got hit for exactly my hit points with a crit. Who would have guessed? Yeah, you're not doing that anymore. This is gonna be enough damage. Yes. Good job at killing two people, Rick, as a vicar. Okay. Let's try this again. You're going off to the side so you can get healed. Ninja's gonna sneak up. Ninja's got an inch. You're gonna attack Bowie. Don't crit. Thank you. You see what I mean? That was double damage compared to normal. Ugh, game. We're going 
forward. Screech, you're gonna go there. Randolph, you're gonna go there. Okay. Jaha. I'm actually going to spread the word rather than attacking, I think. This might be a bad idea, but I don't want Bowie to accidentally die, and that's going to happen otherwise. Kiwi, just move there for now. Yes, please heal up Chester some. Should heal 37? Ah, tired. Maybe this is the only video I'm recording tonight. It is 46 minutes, so that's a reasonable possibility. Yeah, can't reach the puddle, okay. Or I can just kill this thing. See if I can kill it. Apollo! Slice. HP, attack, defense, actually. This is why I wanted to boost, because that counterattack is nasty. I'm not trying to advance too much over on that side right now. Just sit there. My kingdom for aura. Are you kidding me? Crap, now they can kill Bowie. And unless if the initiative deities roll well, I can't do a dang thing about it. his best attack. Guess I'll heal Bowie. <sighs> Bowie will survive at least. Grumble. Hoping to just finish off the dart. Nut. Level up. At least you gained the defense. One. Maybe I should have just invaded through the middle. That might have been easier. We should survive this one. Even with a heavy attack, as long as it's not a double attack, we're fine. <sighs> Rumble. Just die. I only gained 24 XP though. Heal Randolph because he needs it. Just notice I don't have anybody with heal 4. 
and given that both of my healers promoted at relatively high levels, I'm not going to have heal four for a while. All right, those goobers are gonna heal up for a bit. I don't know why their AI script is causing him to run away like that. Bowie needs a lot faster healing than everybody else because he's gonna die otherwise. Weird that nobody's waking up, though. Hmm, that has me a little concerned, actually. I was hoping to trigger some of the people over on the right, that way they would move. It's kind of important. It's the whole point behind my strategy. Chester. Heal one. There we go. Oh, I swear this battle's taking forever. Could be that I've killed like five units and I'm nearly done with the recording. <sighs> it's not even any desert for me to blame this time. Doesn't that put you in range of the harpy? Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, it does. You are healing like this instead. Heal! Positions. Wake some people up. Hopefully lure them over to the right. It's the whole reason why I'm doing this, and it's not working very well. Okay, they've woken up. They've woken up. I think I might have woken everybody up from that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, you're still pretty far. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You're also far, okay. Do not care then. Here would be a good spot to boost, but I'm pretty sure the harpy is gonna just hit me. But I'm gonna try it anyway, because I need to preach the word. There we go. That would be an incredibly dumb idea. That's an almost as dumb idea, isn't it? Yeah. I'm just gonna stay back here for a bit. He'll finish healing up, Bowie. Your movement's five, right? Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, that's what I was expecting to have happen. And that's fine. Freeze 2 is not that much damage anymore. Especially not when that causes the heartbeat to be all by themselves. A boom headshot? 36 damage, nice. Uh, 
Okay, now I'm probably in range, aren't I? Yep, I'm in range. Okay. Uh, I'm too far away to ninja them. Which means... Uh, I don't have a good spot to defend myself at. Oh well. Randolph has defense. It'll be fine. You actually can rage. Must have decently fi feist movement. Fast movement. That's fine. I've only hit the harpy with one attack after all. And, well, I've got a lot more where that comes from. Hi. Bolt tube. up. Not that I'm getting any new spells anytime soon, unfortunately. Kill the harpy, please. What the heck, game? Let's try this again. Kill the harpy, please. Okay. Thank you, Slade. getting really unlucky there. Who's injured, if anybody? Nobody I can reach. Cool. You're gonna hide back there. Vicar, you're gonna beal somebody. No, you're not. Your movement's five. You can hit Bowie. Oh, he's at full. Okay. Heal Yaha. Boop. <coughs> I don't have beverage handy. I'm probably gonna die if I do that, so no. Thank you. That's the character I wanted to move up. That's what I wanted you to do. So Randolph can take hits better than the rest. Yeah, you needed Hank over here. A real one. Not just a bronze one. Ninja stab! Claw stab? Claw stab. Please give me that XP and money. Unfortunately, no damage to Screech. It's what I expected to have happen. Okay, but we can at least take another hit. You're gonna heal yourself for heal three for some weird reason. Instead of a heal one, which would have healed the same amount. Just saying. Oh, hey, look, you lined yourselves up again for me. Why do you keep helping me? Oh, wait, it's because you're cheating for the rest of the game. Oh, well. Freeze. So Freeze 3 does more damage than Bolt 2, it appears. To at least those two goobers. How about you die now, Master Monk? You've outlived your usefulness. Peace. There's nobody left alive over here. I'm just going to start merging my force together again. 
and healing myself, of course, because Kiwi has gobs of everything. Again. He's approaching the level that he should start getting magic again, I think. Didn't I promote Rick at like level 31 or 32 or something like that? Ninja. I'm not really using my archers this or my snips this battle, am I? And I'm already over an hour. Uh Rumble. Your move is seven. Two, three, or sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, yeah. This is fine. I can lure out you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. I'm gonna stand right there. Hi. Hello, idiot. How are you? Bonk. And don't get me wrong, taking 30 damage still hurts. But it's not that big of a deal. She has boost, and I already forgot. Whoops. Uh, let's not use Jaha as much. Well, Jaha for softening is not that big of a deal. I'm just gonna blaze three soften. Oh, that actually did the same amount of damage, huh? Okay. Nope. You. Look. So, fun fact, um, necromancers, so these goobers down here. Um, this is this is a unit that was in Shining Force 1 as well as a surprise unit, namely all of a sudden, you're fighting something with Freeze 3 when you barely have Heal 2. Uh, it hurt. Usually, if something got hit by Freeze 3, it died. And Freeze 3 was quite a bit more powerful in Shining Force 1, at least comparatively. Really? It's really hard to kill things when you keep doing that. I'm just gonna have to start using snipers. Um, you're injured. Bonk. Ninja. Could kill it with a ninja. Um, it's actually not a terrible idea. Don't want it. Bonk. Of course, now I have enough MP to bolt two and bolt one. Oh well. Or bolt three and bolt one. I just won't be. I couldn't rely on the fact that Slade could have gone earlier, but I don't know if he would have. Alright, Randolph still needs healing. Just heal Randolph. Dunk. Okay, this is all land effect zero. Where do we have enemies at this point? Just down there, okay. I'm gonna use this as a natural choke point and you're gonna attack Randolph. Cool, I'm glad I healed him. Okay, he's at one hit point now. I'm getting really unlucky with these double attacks, aren't I? Okay, it's science time. How much damage do each of these do? Dao does 19. Neptune does 31. Katon 2 does 17. 
Yeah, um... Neptune. You know what I think you all need? I think you need to hear about the word. Hello, Kiwi. You need to kill something now. It's been too long. No crit. Try it. What do you do damage? Oh, uh, you could nearly one-shot enemies already, Kiwi. And I haven't even started boosting you that much yet. Alright, we've got those four goobers left. That's it. Randolph, you need healing desperately. Here, have a whole bunch. Ninja. Alright, you have seven movement. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You're going to sit right there. Right there. That should lure it out. Think they may have woken up? Should heal Randolph good enough? Heal him good. Heal him real good. Jaha, um, have you already preached the word to Bowie? No. Or Rick. Hmm. Bowie. So Bowie can use the defense more. Only 4 XP, though. Ugh. Um, just sit there. Just laid. Ah, crap. Can't realize I was in range. I forgot Freeze 3 has really long range. That was not a great plan. Janet being hit might actually kill Janet. And I definitely can't heal anymore. I can heal two at best. Which I might as well. Rick's out of MP now. Good to know. Uh, what's the range on the Devil Soldier? Also, what's its attack? 98. Six movement. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, you're gonna get hit. Oh well. Actually... Oh. Could do that and get three enemies with one bolt, but I would just die. I would die a painful, horrible death. Let's just do that. Slice. Pew. Pew pew. Pew 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 pew. pew. Pew 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 I'm going loopy. Er. Why don't you move back anyway? You're... Yep, you're gonna finish off Janet. Oh. Janet lived. That's nice of you. Anyway. Um, I need to finish off that necromancer before anything else. Because that necromancer is freaking dangerous with how crowded it everybody is. What is it with everybody dodging my attacks this game? Uh, you're actually in the safest spot possible. As long as you don't get counterattacked. You get counterattacked. Bye, Janet. See ya. And unfortunately, that means that Janet doesn't get XP for that attack. Uh, Neptune. Die, Harpy Queen. Die. Just really bad luck this time. Really, really bad luck. Oh well. Not the end of the world. Necromancer, please just stay dead.
Have I said grumble yet? What is your agility? 51. Okay. You actually do have high agility. I was not expecting that. Who's boosted? You're boosted. You're boosted. You're not. You're not. There's my answer. It's a blast! Die. Stay dead. Crit for 46. HP 2, MP 1, Attack 1, Defense 1, Agility 1. But you know what? You can't dodge those. Okay. Uh, they have 98 attack. I have 56 defense. I'd be taking an average of 42 damage. I'm dead on a crit. Bowie has to stay back. Oh, Bowie can use magic. I forgot. Let's have Bowie use magic. Because Dark Bishop's not going to give any XP. Die. Yeah, because Dark Bishops are a um, earlier style of enemy. You have no healing at all. Do you have a healing item? You do. I can't heal people who need it. Because I can't reach. Cool. You're gonna go here. Do you have a healing item? Yes, you do. Ninety-eight, fifty-nine. You're expected to take thirty-nine damage, and you just got boosted. Yeah, this is actually safe. Luke, Nin, Nin. Sorry, I'm trying to speed things up because this battle is dragging. dead now. Yay, level up. HP 2, attack 1, agility 1. No defense, no MP. <sighs> anyway, we need to go to resurrect somebody and then we're stopping. Sorry, Janet. Anyway, I'll talk to you next time, Internet. Maybe I will do one more. Bye!